From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good evening, Center County Student Meteorologist Brian Bells here with your Campus Weather Service forecast for today, February 2nd. Today is Groundhog Day, and this morning, Punxsutawney Phil in Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania saw his shadow this morning, so we are looking at six more weeks of winter. So if you like winter, stay tuned, because it looks like it's going to be a very interesting end of the season. What else we're tracking for today? We're looking at cold temperatures are going to be sticking around. We saw very cold temperatures this weekend, and with the windy conditions that are also going to be sticking around, the wind chill is going to feel very cold out there. Even by Thursday night, we could still be talking about lows in the negative single digits. It's going to be very cold out there throughout the week. We also run the chance for some more snow. Looking ahead to Wednesday, I'll have that in your full seven day coming right up. Temperature change from yesterday. We saw a dramatic cool up after the snow came through. Scranton, 14 degrees cooler. Altoona, 14 degrees cooler. And even down in West Virginia, some 20 degrees cooler than this time yesterday. It's quite chilly out there. Our eye in the future forecast, mapping it out for you. We're looking at partly cloudy skies throughout the evening tonight. Can't rule out a flurry or two, nothing too major. And then some partly cloudy skies throughout the day. Tomorrow we're going to see actually some sunshine for your day on Tuesday. Before Wednesday, some snow moves into the area. We're looking at some light snow showers. Better chance comes late on Wednesday and into the day on Thursday when we could see some snow showers throughout Center County and all throughout the Commonwealth for that matter. Then going into the rest of the day on Thursday, we dry it right back out and we're looking at partly to mostly cloudy skies throughout the Commonwealth. Temperatures throughout that time period, we're looking at single digits tonight down to eight, but it's going to feel a whole lot colder out there with the wind. Winds gusting upwards of 30 miles an hour tonight. For tomorrow, we're going to warm it up into the mid-20s before we cool it back down going into Wednesday and Thursday. Like I mentioned, Thursday night, back down into the negative single digits. That's just the temperature, not the feel-like temperature for Thursday night. Take a look at our feel-like temperatures over the next day or so. We're going to see negative 3 degrees tonight. It's going to feel like right around 1130 tonight. It's going to be bitterly cold out there. So make sure you bundle up if you're headed out over the next few days. Taking a look at our forecast, though, for tonight, frigid temperatures, 3 degrees is all we're calling for, with winds gusting upwards of 30 miles an hour. Partly cloudy skies for tonight. Tomorrow we're going to see some sunshine, sudden clouds, cool temperatures though, 23 degrees. Winds out of the west, 5 to 10. Your seven-day forecast, mapping it out for you. Up to 35 on Wednesday, but look for some uh, snow before we see mostly cloudy skies to end off the week, but look at that. Cold temperatures, negative 2 degrees Thursday night, and then only 19 for Friday before some snow moves back in. Late in the weekend, it looks like Sunday we could see a few snow showers in the area. That's all from the Campus Weather Service. We'd like to thank you for tuning in.